Hey everyone, welcome back to BDN. I'm Trent. And I'm Paris. Hey seniors, we're excited to say that Senior Night has finally been scheduled. It's April 11th. The ever so delicate and delightful Miss Alsop is over this year and she is ready to start planning. Now, one thing we need for sure are pictures and videos from you. BDN's very own JP Wombo is creating a senior video featuring favorite memories of your senior year. You can either get your pictures to JT directly or send them to our Blue Devil News Instagram or Facebook account at LHS Blue Devil News. Also, seniors, please go pay your sen senior fee of $65 at the bank. They can take cash or check. You can pay online, but they'll charge a convenience fee. The full balance is due February 1st. The district-wide art show at the 1st in Nashville is opening February 1st from 10 a.m. to 5.30 p.m. The show is open for viewing this Sunday to February 9th. However, there is a free admission on Saturday, February 1st, out of 256 kids. LHS has 18 artists. Be sure to go downtown and support your Blue Devils. Now let's go take a look at what some of our outstanding Blue Devils have conquered in our new segment of Blue Devils Spotlight. Hi everyone and welcome back to Blue Devils Spotlight. During this segment, we want to spotlight some of the outstanding accomplishments your peers have obtained. As you know, over the break this year, we have had Achieve 3000 Challenge. Prizes range from $25 to $100. Congratulations to the following for winning the Winter Break Contest. First place receiving $100 is Junior Joshua Dickerson. Second place receiving $75 is freshman Rebecca Dial. Third place receiving $50 is sophomore Vagnia Ashworth. And fourth place receiving $25 is Junior Corby Patel. Vagnia Ashworth also won a drawing for a prize, Sony headphones. Nationwide, all students who completed at least five articles over the break were put in a drawing, and one name from each state was drawn. Last week, Hosa competed at regionals. We had several plays to advance to state competition. Zach Marshall, dental terminology. Sylvestria Berea, interviewing skills. Brittany Moore, medical math. Mackenzie Moore, Abby Gore, Nacy Patel, Pranav Patel, public health. And many more. Congratulations, everyone, and good luck at state. Also, a huge shout-out to senior soccer player Molly McElhiney. She will be signing to play soccer with Motlow tomorrow at 9.30. Coach Farron says Molly is a dedicated, hardworking student athlete. She is a leader and encourager on and off the field. She has had two huge games against Mount Juliet this year, where she had over 30 saves each. She led by example and always helped clean up the field. She's a great teammate. BDN will have Molly's full signing later next week. Well, that's all I have for Blue Devil Spotlight. I'm Ian. Back to you guys. Wow, congratulations to everyone. And we look forward to hearing more in the future. Musical auditions are today. Make sure to check out the info outside the auditorium and all the performing art classrooms for a detailed rundown of auditions. The Snowball Dance is this Saturday. Tickets are $10 and on sale at the bank. The dance is from 7 to 10 here at LHS. Today, there is a meeting for any student council members that are helping with planning. There are also a boys freshman basketball team today starting at 6 o'clock at home against Mount Juliet. It's hard to believe that prom 2020 is just 12 weeks away. This year, your adventure awaits. Prom will be at the mill on April 17th. Tickets are $55 and can be purchased at the bank or online. If you buy your tickets before March 6th, you'll get a free shirt. The library will be holding a contest for the rest of the month. Stop by the library and guess how many snowflakes are in the jar for a chance to win a $10 gift card of your choice. The Environmental Club has a trip to the Tremont Institute on February 7th through 6th and is open to all students. The cost is $258, but that includes everything. It's first to come, first serve, and any students can come to C206 during this week to ask questions or pick up forms. There will also be a meeting on Friday after school in C206 that all students can come to. The Blue Devil Rugby Football Club is now recruiting for its fourth season. No experience necessary. Our practice starts today. Learn a great new sport, increase your athletic abilities, and have fun. You may be wondering, what in the world is rugby? Let's take a peek. Rugby 101, the basics. 
rugby was first played in England in 1823 when legend has it, William Webb Ellis picked up a football and ran with it. There are 15 players and 7 reserves in a rugby team and it is played on a grass field with an oval ball. The ball may be carried forward Again, is the, uh, player. or kicked forward Drops it on but and must only be passed back backwards to teammates. A game lasts for 80 minutes, broken into 40 minute halves. The object is to ground the ball over the opposition goal line and score a try like this. Or more like this. All the while defending their own goal line from being crossed by the opposition. And the same 15 players remain on the field regardless of whether they are attacking or defending. Putting some real pressure on the All Black line here, five metres away. Murray Hoy didn't see it. Sevilla pounces and Smith works blind. Scoring a try is worth five points and it also gives the team a chance to add a further two points if the goal kicker can convert the try. This is done by kicking the ball from the ground to between the goalposts. For example, and one more thing, the kick must be taken in line with where the try was scored. The other way to score points is by kicking a penalty goal, awarded after an infringement by the other team. Or a drop goal, that's when a player bounces the ball on the ground before striking it. And both of these are worth three points each. Meet at Cedar City Trails Park on Tuesdays and Thursdays from 3.30 p.m. until dark. Across LHS, park behind, bank, or walk from the school. Training starts this Thursday, January 23rd. February 8th, the softball team is hosting a Chili Supper and silent auction fundraiser in the cafeteria and commons. Make sure to talk to the softball team about tickets. You can get them online. That's all the news we have today, LHS. I'm Trent. And I'm Paris. This, this has been news to you from the White and Blue.